Hi, I'm Mark Littler. I'm an independent antiques consultant and whiskey broker. I set up my business in 2016, and since then I've helped sell millions of pounds worth of antiques and whiskey for my clients. What type of cask should you invest in, or what age of cask should you invest in? Now, we've got a lot of experience. We've sold millions of pounds worth of casks for customers that have seen a good and substantial profit on them. But all of these customers, the common trait was that they bought a young cask of whiskey and then waited 15 to 30 years and sell it as a mature cask of whiskey. Now, we only advise in investing in young casks of whiskey, which are broadly speaking less than five years old. The main reason for this is that the majority of the purchase price is consisting of objective costs. The cost of the cask. So for instance, that can be anywhere between 250 and 1,000 pounds just for the wooden cask alone. You've then got the cost of the whiskey that's going inside it. You've then got the cost of the uplift and the removal of the cask into a bonded warehouse or the administrative processes. And of course, our brokerage fee as well. With older casks, these are a lot more subjective, these charges, because you still have the objective costs of the casks that you would experience with a young cask, but then you've got the improved quality and scarcity, which is of course all very subjective. So we only advise if you're looking to buy a cask of whiskey is to buy a young cask, less than five years old, roughly speaking. I hope you found this video useful and there are another nine videos in this series. If you've got any questions about a cask that you're looking to buy, or indeed would like our help to buy a cask, then please visit the website and get in touch.